What's the word, y'all? It's Davion Seen It. I'm back with another video. If you're new, hit that like and smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into it. Today, we're going to be talking about Power Book 2, Season 3, the upcoming season that should be airing sometime in the fall. Let's get right into it. So now, Season 2 ended about a couple months ago, and then we followed it up with Tommy's show. Now, Season 2 ended with a bang. It was a lot of open plot points that needs to be complete, completed by the next season. So, first thing I want to talk about is the death of Zeke. Rest in peace, Zeke. Now, once Monet and the family finds out that it was Lorenz who killed Lorenzo who killed Zeke on that plane, yeah, best believe it's going to fracture the family. The family's going to get fractured a lot. Now, I have a feeling that it may cause some division between the siblings. It's definitely going to cause a division between um, Monet and her whole entire family as a whole. Or maybe Lorenzo may be the enemy. And I feel like Lorenzo probably may not die. Maybe in like around maybe till season four or five. But let's focus on this season. I just want to give my little premonition on his death. But I feel like this season, Lorenzo is going to be one of the main villains. Because once they find that out, and I feel like they're going to find that out at some point of the show. Probably like around episode 5. Because episode 5 of Power gets crazy. And then so on and so forth. So forth. Lorenzo's going to be the enemy. Um, Tariq is going to be in deep trouble once again. Um, it's going to be even harder for him to get out of this one. Because they got him on camera on the, crime, on the scene of the crime. Where Mecca got killed from Mary J. Blige. Monet, aka. Um, so Tariq is going to be in over his head once again um the lawyer davis mclean is gonna have to come in handy and you know he's gonna be taxing like a he's gonna be taxing so Tariq is gonna have to go deeper in the business alongside with brayden um rest in peace diana don't be surprised if a family member of diana's show up in this season don't be surprised because if you watch power you know that whoever dies in one of the seasons one of their relatives that we never even heard of that's never been mentioned pops up it happens all the time look at the tommy show we didn't even know this dude had a brother or maybe i wasn't paying attention but it doesn't really matter but let's talk about the death of mecca now mecca's death being that he was a global snitch is going to cause a trick a trickle effect because now they he's his death has shut down this whole entire operation so they're gonna go digging and i'm talking about digging they're gonna dig up old files on ghosts from when he got arrested they're gonna try to pinpoint um tariq and don't be surprised make no mistake that they're gonna be talking about ghosts they're gonna be talking about his death the rest of this series until they pin it on on tariq don't be surprised if tariq ends up going to jail by the end of the series for ghost's death now you have Kane. Now, Kane, on the other hand, I have a feeling that at some point he may end up having conflict with his father, being that Kane had to step up and replace his father's authority, being that he was the oldest. And, you know, it may cause them to bump heads. Expect them to bump heads a lot. Now, expect Tariq and Brayden to bump heads a lot because Brayden did some sneaky stuff. He didn't keep it all the way 100 with Tariq as far as the business move. Now, F.A., on the other hand, I don't know. She may be loyal for a small part of the season, but don't be surprised if she pulls some funny stuff because F.A. is really sneaky. And don't be surprised that if Tariq starts focusing more on, on himself and starts distancing himself away from F.A., that that's going to be a problem. Now, I want to know who's going to be the new plug, the new distro, whoever is going to be. Um, this person has to be incredible. He has to be powerful and he has to live up to Mecca. Now, I feel like with Mecca, I bet I feel like he died a little too soon for me. And who's this blast of music? Don't mind the music. And I feel like we could have got a little bit more with his story arc. But at the end of the day, it was done for a reason. And I'm pretty sure they're going to come up with a better story arc because power, they never run out of material. They always add in something that's going to have us like... So, those are my, I, I was trying to say, I, I, I was about to say that, but I said those. I was supposed to say those. But those are my predictions for the upcoming season of Power Book 2, Ghosts. 
um y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section um hit that like smash that subscribe button and i got a lot of more content coming for y'all um i may be dropping a snowfall season six prediction my quick thoughts what it's going to be like this week um you know sometimes i don't always keep my promises and i'm tired of these broken promises promise oh, never mind i don't know why i even saying that because i sung it out of key i'm not going to try it again <laughs> but y'all let me know what y'all think hit that like subscribe i'm up out of here y'all be easy y'all i'm out